Good afternoon. Happy President's Day. We are at Animal Kingdom today. It's another one of our final little meals. Well, not really like a meal, but like dining experiences. But sadly, we think this is going to be the last time we come into Animal Kingdom. Right. We so have not to come just, on the weekend. Not just the last dining, but our first last park. Yes. And so we're going to Nomad Lounge today, which we've actually never done before. Just heard great things about. Jamesy Boy's like kind of on his way to a nap. We'll see. So we'll see, but we want him to go on the safari today. That's and our maybe goal. dinosaur child swap. Well, yeah, I don't think he can go on the dinosaur. <laughs> Disney. Look at that cute little Mickey Mouse. I like it. I feel like it, for some people it could scratch that itch. To me it's weird that it's just like general run Disney, not like a specific to a race thing. And I know that's all general run Disney stuff, but it like looks a little differently. Yeah. But I mean, I like it's it. nice, but it's also like it's sad because the events aren't happening. Princess would have been on its way. We should get those socks. Sarah just threw out a pair of my running socks. I threw out a pair of your running socks because they had holes in them. We joined the walk-up list for Nomad Lounge. The wait was 40 minutes, and we've been waiting about a half hour, so hopefully we'll get our text soon in the next 10, 15 minutes. I totally forgot that the Club 33 is right here, and I've seen people coming and going. I'm jealous. It's in the 80s, it's really toasty today. This feels like it feels like it's supposed to feel when you're at Animal Kingdom. Oh my gosh, more people are coming. They're going fast. Those ducks are speedy. The feeling of Animal Kingdom is just like next level amazing. Especially like I love this song. Oh, steel drum coming our way. Fun fact, uh, we had a very productive morning, wouldn't you say? Yeah, we did. I did in fact wake up and actually ran my 12 miles. Yes, I edited, we just like... I had to do work because you know time. I do weekend work stuff. And James has been so chit chatty lately, it's just so fun to play with him. So we're moseying back towards no man like thinking into existence that our table's gonna get called. Yes. Because we're getting close to the time where they should call us. Yeah. Look at that, it worked. Right as we're turning the corner, literally to be in front of Tiffin's, I get the text message. So here are the specials for No Man Lounge right now. And of course they have the QR code on the back side to do the full menu. And we're in a nice AC. Jamesy Boy is actually awake now. So Sarah's trying to, trying to see what's going on there. I like really wanted to sit outside, but with it being so toasty, I'm very happy in this air conditioning. Yeah. I don't know what, maybe it's just because like we're not dressed for it to be right. warm. We, we both are wearing pants and yeah. we knew going into it that it was going to be hot, but like we're also... like peak sun. Right, we came right at like 1 o'clock. Yeah, we're no soaking clouds. it up though. Yeah. We know what we're headed to. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, oh my gosh, this lobster mac and cheese, the last time we were here, I think it was the summer, yeah. we are at Tiffin's, we were still fully plant-based. And I saw somebody order the lobster mac and cheese and I like saw it come out and I was like I'm done. <laughs> questioning everything and they have it and so Getting it. Jamesy Boy joined us. The impossible sliders are so. This mac and cheese, I'm like scared because it looks so good. <laughs> and how is your drink? What did you order? 
tempting tigress. Mm -hmm. I called it the temptress <laughs> when I ordered it. And the server was like, what? Um, really good. My friend, my buddy Steve suggested it. It's the only time I'll give him the credit for anything good. So. It's got bourbon in it, right? Yes. All right, we're gonna do a, a live first POV opening day review. It's like... Oh. All right. Authentic. Just get in there and burn the roof of your mouth like it's oven pizza. Is it delicious? Are those shells? Shell wow. noodles. It's like my dream. Delicious or no? Oh, it's be honest. You hate it. So good. Do you order and it? Like it yeah. tastes like I didn't. I don't think I even had like a bite of lobster, but like you could taste the flavor of lobster. Good. We're splitting that number. Didn't like that at all. It's so good. I would get a whole nother one. I just. I just feel like this is Joe Rohde's like favorite room in all of Animal Kingdom, but I had to show this before I leave because Sarah and James actually left to go to baby care while I waited to close out the bill. One of the things I've wanted to do my entire life as a aspiring father. We're in our favorite baby care, Animal Kingdom. <coughs> James has got lots to say. Just ate a snack. And we're going to go on a safari. Thank you. That is the best part of all four parks. <laughs> all right, I think potentially the only attraction. Thank you. 15 minutes in all shades. James Very first important. time on here. Yeah, it's honestly, a big one. Sales. I've been going on this in so long. I've been going on this since 2019. And I may not have either. Yeah. Wow. This is going to be great. Um, 15 minutes, this is a straight walk on. This is awesome. A good safari. Very hot. It is very moist. Sorry, <laughs> I won't. I won't be lovey dovey. But yeah. we saw there is only um, the parks open until eight, but there are only safaris until 5:45. So we saw some of the animals like going to bed for the night, like the ostriches. Um, really cool to see the warthogs. What else did we see that wasn't the new goat thing at the end? Cheetahs. Oh yeah, we saw two cheetahs. Those sleepy lions. Such a good one. I tried to convince Peter to go on it again. With the with the animals going to bed, I yeah. was like, let's just enjoy. enjoy the rest of the park. And James E agreed. Yeah. Look at Alpha going Really wish we could have seen Finding Nemo the musical before we moved. Oh, well, does it have to come back? Yeah. James just got angry at the sun. He was just like, ah. <laughs> It's so fun! Kind of sad, one last look at the tree. We were about to leave and Sarah goes, wait, we gotta do one last look. It's the first time. We'll be back so soon. And really, we really will. June, right? June's happening no matter what. We love you, Animal Kingdom.
Yes, we have left Animal Kingdom and though we are sad, the night is actually still young and continues. It's also still a continuation of being sad because we're going to hang out with the Petrises, which we know we only have limited amount of times to hang out with them before we move. And they're going to be one of like the saddest people to say goodbye to. So I'm running into Target to grab some pizzas and maybe a Red Bull. And it, to me, like, I know I've been off my running game compared to like this time last year. But I have been better the past month and a half, but I am burned out from my run. Look at Megan's awesome shirt. I love it. Also, they have the new Mario and I'm gonna play this. We're really far. I, this looks it's so fancy kind of, to me. It's sad how far we are. No. It's a short period of time. <laughs> this is the first time I'm playing it and Megan and Kitty didn't realize how good I am at Mario games. I mean, he got way further than we did. Ever. But then we died right at the end. We did use teamwork because there's a few times where I didn't know what was going on and I was just a floating <laughs> bubble. That was an episode that had, or a, a level that has a lot going on. But it's pizza time. Look at this pizza. Look at this pizza. What's the crust? It looks normal. It looks like a normal crust here. It's like flaky. Oh. See this? It's a croissant crust. It's good. Bye bye Bowser. Welcome back, Wishes. <laughs> Look at this child. He's been very antisocial since we've been here, but at least he's comfy here. He's enjoying the sounds of Mario. <laughs> it's very relaxing. I swear I will update this calendar in this week. James has a doctor's appointment tomorrow, so I don't know if it'll be tomorrow, but I'll try. February 15th, the goal is to laugh forever with someone you take serious, anonymous. That is definitely Peter and I. Mr. Jamesy has been asleep in our room since we got home and it's been weird. Yeah, it was very fresh we got here and him just to be, <laughs> sorry for him, you <laughs> just asleep in there. But Eve just ran in there. Eve's been kind of concerned about it. She's like, this is strange. Yeah. The, that thing is not supposed to be alone in there. Well, he definitely woke up because she just rattled her collar, collar in the bedroom. I turned it off just now. Oh, okay. Anyway, it was a great weekend. Mm -hmm. um, real productive, real fun. Slightly sad at times, slightly happy at times. I don't know what she's doing in there. I, can, I think I heard her jump on the bed. It's good to be home. <laughs> it's good to be home. We officially move next week. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.